Thomas, based on your sketch, I have a model. This here would be the air compressors. It would be entirely open air. This uh, here will be entirely enclosed by windows and by plastic sheets. So in other words, this here is waterproof. As seen in your sketch, this beam here is parallel to the wall here. And the same with this, the beam here is parallel with the wall here. And the measurement for the 3 inch beam would be here. So, 3 inch. Three inch. The pillars for the front are starting from the ground up to the canopy, and there are three pillars in total. And I'll explain why later. So, as I said, the beam is parallel to the uh, wall and at the side the beam is also parallel to the wall however because of the slope of the canopy the and the fact that this beam has to be completely horizontal a triangle is created so it can be enforced by two stanchions so the windows will cover the windows will cover here The back here will be covered by a plastic sheet and it is unmovable. Also a plastic sheet will cover the area between the top of the white partition and the beam and it's unmovable. So to summarize, um, the 3mm beam width requirement uh, is only required for two sides of the canopy. Two sides of the canopy. Uh, the other requirements are the jutting out of the uh, canopy by uh, 20 centimeter 20 centimeters reminder that the pillars in front they start from the ground and the reason being is that the wall here has to be left completely unobstructed so that the track for the window can be affixed later on. You would also notice that there is a beam which is right above the white partition. 
So this will make it easy. This will make it easy to place a plastic sheet between the beam and the white partition. So I hope that uh, is uh, my explanation is good, and I uh, hope to hear from you soon.